Are you dreaming of scoring 200 plus marks in JEE in 2026 but feel time is slipping away? You have just 5 months left. If you have promised your parents you will do well, if you have already dedicated 2 years of hard work, this is the time to push harder than ever. This is your final chance. Think of the regret you would have if you don't work hard now. This is your call. So go grab a pen and notebook and listen carefully. I am going to share a step by step strategy that can guarantee you a huge percentile boost if you follow with discipline. So tip number 1 become relentlessly consistent. From now on hard work is non-negotiable. You need to put in 10 to 12 focused hours every single day. But remember, merely sitting on your desk for 12 hours is not just enough. What really matters is active learning, reading concepts, solving problems, revising and analyzing mistakes. Use Pomodoro technique, a 15 minute study and a 10 minute break or deep focus blocks to stay efficient and every night quickly review what you've studied during the day. This will help you retain more and for longer. Tip number 2, start revising. This is the perfect time to start revising all important chapters. Make a priority list of topics from which more questions appeared in JEE in 2025. Start revising chapters you feel you are already confident in. This will help you build momentum. For every subtopic, solve 3 to 4 quality questions. After revision, summarize key formulas and concepts and note them down in a short notes book. So the plan is by the end of August you should be done with class 11 topics and by the end of September you should be done with class 12 topics. The short notes book will become your ultimate weapon in the last month. And here comes the pro tip. Start giving full syllabus mock tests very early. Most students wait too long but you should start giving full syllabus mock tests by October. You can start taking tests from NTABS app. Even if your syllabus isn't 100% complete, mock tests will help you learn time management, master the skill of selecting easy questions first, identify weak areas early. Remember, JE isn't just about knowledge. It's about exam strategy. Here is step number 4. PYQ is the 99 percentile secret. Many toppers say if you master PYQ properly, you can easily hit 99 plus percentile. Get a chapter wise PYQ book first. You can either get a Disha or physics like physics wala book. Solve and analyze every question deeply, but don't solve 2025 papers because you can solve them as mock tests later. And one important thing, at this point of time, do not spend your time on fancy books like Erodo or Bunsen. Last but not the least, here are a few subject specific hacks that can change your game entirely. Math. Even 50 plus marks in math can get you 99 plus percentile. However, math can be very stressful. But if you follow these chapters and learn them properly, you can get 99 plus percentile very easily. So focus on these chapters: differential equations, matrices and determinants, vectors, probability, statistics and permutations and combinations. physics do all pyqs thoroughly focus on ncrt based concepts plus past 10 to 15 years of je main questions physics pyqs often have simple but slightly tricky twists so analyze patterns carefully complete all topics physics sometimes goes off trend so don't skip anything revise smartly with eduniti youtube video series use these videos for quick concept refresh and solving a few high yield questions chemistry Prioritize organic chemistry because it's 45% of the paper. Do not skip amines, aldehydes and biomolecules. Inorganic looks boring but salt analysis coordination compounds give guaranteed questions. For physical, focus on formulas plus PYQ practice. Here's an important game-changing exam strategy. Try completing physics and chemistry in 1.5 hour and math in other 1.5 hour. You might ma- keep track of the time. You might find difficulty at first but you will find its benefits coming later. Finally, remember this. The next 5 months can completely change your future. Do not think about how much syllabus is left or what you couldn't do before. Just focus on today. If you stay consistent, revise smartly, solve PYQs and give mock tests seriously, 
200 plus marks is 100% achievable so believe in yourself work hard and you will make it happen i am very sure i am very sure every all the viewers watching can definitely do it so for more j preparation strategies make sure to like share and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one guys bye